stuff. Um, smaller one. Yeah, so these are all ledgers. This one is all onion skin. Or no, this one is all onion skin. This one is just like ledger paper. So, yeah, so those are ledger pages. Um, some of the loose pages are just kind of rolled up back here. And then, oh, <laughs> this is the paint drawer. I have not been in this drawer much lately. So I really need to go through all of this paint and just probably get rid of a bunch of it. And then this is all file folders. Um, yeah, green ones mostly. <laughs> um, there's some like gift boxes and stuff in here that I got on clearance and whatnot. Okay, and then this drawer is kind of like my extra supplies drawer. So rubber bands, uh, labels, pieces, parts for my scanning cut, um, paper trimmers I don't use very often, my tape runner that I don't use very often anymore, envelope punch board. Um, this is where I keep like my clean rags that have been washed that's where they go there's a label printer in there that i never use a couple of irons one of them is for using with um encaustic or wax you know oh this is my sewing machine light <laughs> um extra glue guns some peroxide blah 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 and then this drawer is all like book pages that I want to, books that I want to harvest pages from, or books that I've already harvested pages from, and I don't want to put them back on the shelf, things like that. Um, I've scanned a lot of stuff out of this book, but it just goes in there anyway. <laughs> um, yeah, so these are books that I would like to pull pages from for the most part, or just like extra book pages that I will go through and you know this is a this is my old fussy cutting um situation here so a lot of this stuff was things that I wanted to fussy cut but yeah I need to organize this drawer I think and then this is all like flash cards and card type things tickets um little labels and Library cards, there's a ton of index cards, guest checks, guest checks that have already been torn off, dividers, these are like um, the jewelry envelopes, stuff like that. Stuff that I buy on Amazon in bulk that, you know, um, some tickets, some old bingo cards, these are like the little flash cards, you know, these are all little little tags like those little tags little price tags so and then this is what's left of all my like alteration tags and stuff like that so those all go in there and then this drawer is all like bags and envelopes primarily bags um this is the library pockets though there's two sizes of library pockets in there but this is all bags so all like paper bags different sizes um, or like you know the craft envelopes and stuff like that so yeah I got a bunch of this size the like five by seven I love them okay <laughs> um, so this little drawer well first off that dresser is where I have all my stamping stuff so and my plants that have survived the winter so I'll just kind of show you real quick. This video is getting long. But anyways, these are stamps that I can just grab. I can either grab the whole tray out of here or I can just come and pick out a few that I want to use. And then like my acrylic blocks and stuff are in here. So that's that drawer. These are like larger like background stamps and stuff like that. Like just bigger stamps. I don't use stamps that much, but for some reason I have a ton of them. And this is all like ink and stuff like that. Inks and the little color bursts and whatnot. 
larger acrylic blocks, some applicators, and then this is all stamps that I hardly ever use. Um, these are like extra stencils, those little metal stencils, and then some of those. Got a whole bunch of those brass, like letterpress type of things. Anyway, so that's that section over there still needs some work, but um, well, then there's this shelf here that's like all ephemera stuff, so it's all like like flashcards and playing cards and um, you know things I can grab to use in journals. This is all stuff I need to sort out. Um, yeah, this is just just a bunch of a bunch of stuff that needs sorted. Same with that. Um, so this this is where I want to put my stuff that is for sewing that I want to use all the time. Care Heart, if you watch this video, I am still gonna make those bags for you. I just haven't gotten around to it. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so this is all like seam binding and uh, sari silk that I can dye or just white, you know. And then this is all like bandage, as I love those bandages. This is a big roll of it. Um, and then uh, cheesecloth. Okay. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna sit down for the rest of this. Well, anyway, um, there's my windows, my paper lantern. Um, this is the one carousel that I do have. I need to get like three more, I think. Um, and I had a customer slash viewer slash friend send that to me. Anyway, so this is tags and stuff from the last journal project that I was working on that need to get put away. This is actually a sewing box that I thought I could put the stuff I'm going to actually use in. <laughs> I don't know. Either in that or in that drawer. I don't know. Um, this is the paper catch-all thing from my desk that needs to be sorted through like like this needs to go on my desk because I use it a lot um, so this is all my little tiny tags so this didn't change back here much I think it I did have some other stuff up on top of it but I'm trying to eliminate having things on top of there so that I can still see out the window I would love to be able to just turn around and see out that window <laughs> because I can't see out the other window um, when I'm looking the other way in the room anyway so this is all just little little tags little tiny ones these are generally what I use when I'm pricing things or not pricing but um, putting like a stock number on a journal or something. So this is my embosser that I got from Signet Stamps. This is embossing supplies. Um, these are for the giveaway, the little mini journal and the two sets of stamps. And then this is all my vintage um, labels and whole reinforcers and stuff. This is all my book binding stuff in here, all the waxed linen and stuff. This is all thread. These three boxes are all thread, so I need to go through them and pick out what I'm going to put like somewhere that I definitely need to use. <laughs> it's my tape runner or my tape gun. Um, so these are my logo stamps in here. They all just live in here, and I would like to have them on a carousel. But I need like a heavy duty kind of carousel, I think. And then this is all label stamps in here. These are dictionary pages that I've ripped out with images that I want to make into labels. Um, yeah, so that's all label stamp stuff. I've purchased a couple of different reds um, to find a good red to use with those labels. And I will show you the results of my experiment pretty soon. These are some extra sets of label stamps. And so I still have this paper organizer thing on my the filing cabinet bank behind my desk. Um, 
these are more file folders that are like heavier. Um, this is what I was using for the book boards or the writing boards, I mean. And so like I have a bunch more of these. So I was going to make some heavier writing boards using this file folder material. And then I have those zipper bags right here behind me so that when I have a collection of something that I want to keep all together, I can just reach around and grab one of those bags and then it goes in the appropriate drawer. Um, this is empty. These are some tiles that I need to trim, some extra, um, <coughs> an extra roll of uh, masking paper for God knows why it's in there. Anyway, so these are just different papers that I like to print on. And this is all stuff. This is all French stuff that I that I pulled to uh, pull things out of for my minis. I think I'm going to use these little airmail envelopes for the covers, I think. Um, yeah, so that's just paper. And then... This drawer is all my book pages and whatnot, you know, books that I can pull stuff out of. And then this one is basically the same, just more books that I can, that I can use for projects. <laughs> my funky old slippers. Oh my gosh. I was out in the driveway in my good slippers the other day and they got all wet getting firewood. Anyway, so this is the drawer that has, like, that all of that stuff needs to go in. So it all needs to go back in here. So this is all just, like, journal stuffing things, you know, just things to put in journals. So it's kind of like my store. I can come and just, like, shop in here for things for journals. And then... <clears throat> This drawer has some empty space, which is nice, but it's all tape, washi tape, other tape, and then that's that little, that's that box of little tiny ephemera, you know, and then like my labels, my um, preserve labels. So, okay, that's what the, that's what's in that drawer, and then this one has more of these bags, and I'm telling you. Man, I just, I don't know. I just love them. I think they're awesome. Um, so this is stuff that needs to go in a bag. But see, even like the different sizes, um, the smaller sizes, I just put them in a basket in here. And I don't know. I just think it works really good. And they're clear so you can see what's in them. You don't have to put labels on them because you can basically see through it, you know. I don't know, like these are all little words and it's just a great way to keep all that random weird odd shaped stuff all together and consolidate like I've consolidated so much stuff just by using these bags like these are all words you know um, images that I need to cut apart extra stuff that I've printed um, these are all purchased images like Mrs. Cog's images and Tracy Fox images and other ephemera and stuff. So, yeah, so I really recommend those bags, um, just because they're not expensive and I think they're awesome. Anyway, so this is all envelopes. <laughs> it's just all full of envelopes and, um, yeah person does not need that many envelopes but I don't know maybe I do okay so back around okay so that's it there's my bookshelves <laughs> so it's like a total disaster but those are my bookshelves and there's my fireplace and that corner back there I still need to do a bunch of work like that's my those are all my printers and stuff and then all the stuff on top of that metal shelf is all tiles stuff and charms like for like the you know junky charms it's just all stuff that needs to get kind of reorganized and you know anyway see it's all back up in the corner those are all my flower books up there that I like to pull pages from so anyway 
Okay, you guys, I think that was enough. I have no idea. This is almost an hour. <laughs> okay, let me know what you think. And um, yeah, share back. Okay, love you. Bye for now.